Hello guys and welcome into another video and I'm gonna be talking about the setup but here for Daily RSB on Deep Forest Raceway I'm using a different car so you can buy this car for around a million it's actually a million credits it's not really cheap to be honest but you don't have to do any modifications so you only have to tune it up a little bit right there so this got me into the global top 10, as you can see here, the top 10 stars. Uh, if we disregard a couple of these guys that are using kind of a cheat, I would say. So I was even a P7. So if you just uh, mo remove two people out there, I'm going to be about P7. So I think there is a lot more potential in the lab. But the only thing that I've changed here, which I would say that, you know, kind of made a significant uh, improvement is that moving the ballast positioning. So you need to add a ballast. So 200 kilos and then you move it 38 uh, plus 38 to the right. So it make, actually makes the car a little bit more stable and a lot better. So if you want to take a screenshot of this, you can just take a screenshot and try it on your car. The setup really needs a little bit more work in my opinion, but I think I got a pretty solid result with it. So it was a 34.990 and I'm going to lead you through the lap a little bit. So braking right before the 150, brake straight. So it's very important not to use too much braking here and use the downshift as late as you can. So try to downshift as late as you can as you're going out of those turns. I've even got the, on the grass here. And I also have to say that you always want to be pointing out straight. So whenever you're going in a corner or out of the corner, so you want to be straight. Because this is how you activate the battery. And you actually see, I'm always trying to get to the middle of the screen. I'm always trying to straighten up the car as much as I can. And I actually lost a lot of time here. So second gear the up here, straighten up the car. Third gear, as you can see, those, those little movements to the uh, just to the middle. And then I'm getting that, uh, getting that a little additional time. So here... Uh, Breaking third and then right before here you just want to downshift into second to get even more rotation and then when you're getting out of this corner it's third gear so why not second because when you you will actually lose a lot of time when you upshift in third so that's why I upshift early to get more time here and as much you know as you hold your wheel straight you will activate the battery better like that right in between the 150 and 200 you break and here see second and then first it's going to rotate the car and very, very early on the power. So second gear out, not first. So you just want to downshift in the first gear and then it's going to rotate the car. And once again, straight up. So I wasn't probably using as much as I could, but, you know, it eventually got me into the global top 10. So I was very, very happy with the result, but this has a lot more potential. So 34.9, I hope you like uh, what I'm doing. I hope you like the channel so you can even put that like button or subscribe if you like. Once again guys, thank you very much for watching and I really hope um, you know, I'm going to help I'm you to improve your time. See you next time. Bye.